Maybe I'll live it. <gasps> a horse? Oh, <gasps> a horse? What? That's a funky animation, but wow. What? Who went in there? Oh, shoot. I have to probably go and fix that. This is going to be a timed puzzle, isn't it? Or... And you say this happened right after that phantom horse showed up again? The pump house blew just as the horse was galloping oh, away. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, my, this is awful. Maybe Shorty was right. Maybe that horse is a bad omen. Yeah. I'm more inclined to think that someone is using that horse to divert attention. What do you mean? It's possible that while everyone's mm, attention was on that horse, someone, someone sabotaged. sabotaged the pump house. Why on earth would someone sabotage the pump house? Okay, so here's the thing is that Mr. Super Deep Voice, he left first, but that wasn't enough time to go into that route, into that place, and sabotage it. And the other guy, he left, but none of them, like, we had. Did we have the. No, we didn't have it. But the other guy, that just. It was kind of not enough time. I don't think it's the guy in the kitchen because. He was leaving, and the second he left, unless there was a time lapse that we didn't know about. So I'm trying to, I'm trying to, I want to guess who the culprit is before we get to that point. And we've only got four characters so far. But we barely know anything about the woman in the shop. Hey, someone, could someone be trying to get back at you for something? Could someone be trying to get back at you for something? I can't imagine who. It's, they probably I want this out. treasure. You don't think Tex or Shorty or Dave is somehow involved, do you? It's possible, but I just don't know yet. Oh, my. Hmm. You might not be safe there. Maybe we should send her home. I'll be fine. Really, I want to help. And I can help. Well, it sounds like we could certainly use your help. Can you think of mm. any reason why someone might want you off yep. the ranch? No, but I'll tell you what. Ed and I will put our thinking caps on, and if anything comes to us, we'll call you. Have you called the sheriff and told him all this? Not yet. Tell her about the storm. Tell me about the what? The oh, storms. no, what now? You need to be careful when you go riding, because it can be sunny one minute and pouring down rain oh, the next. Oh, no. I'll be careful. Good. Now they've and added this mechanic. Questions, just call. One more thing. Until I figure out what's going on, it would probably be a good idea not to mention my suspicions to anyone at the ranch. Of course. Keep in touch. I, I will. will. Bye. All right. Uh, I wonder if there's like a hidden trap door under a rug or something. <clears throat> because unless we get to go through here at some point, but what on earth kind of treasure could we be? Clearly whoever this is either... Oh! I can actually look at this. Oh! Mineral deposits? Hmm? Uh -huh. Mineral deposits? Oh. Can I help you find something? No, actually, I pretty much found everything on my own. For your information, I got those maps because I was hoping there might be a long lost gold mine or two around here. But like most of my get rich quick mm. ideas, it didn't pan out. Apparently, there's no gold left in them thar hills. Or huh. silver or copper or anything else. Now, I don't ever want to catch you in my stuff again. Noted. Didn't mean to. Can I talk to you? Yes. I'm embarrassed that you caught me snooping through your stuff. Just proves we're birds of a feather. I've been known hmm. to go poking through other people's stuff myself. Have you been out to the pump house? All the water to the ranch house has been cut off. The livestock will still oh, get no. water from the windmills, but we humans are going to have to get every single drop of water we use from the faucet in the pump house. And that's going to be a royal pain. Why can't that darn horse do its cursed thing somewhere else? You really think what mm. happened to the pump house was the result of bad luck? I saw the pipe. It was rusted through. That's why it oh. burst. That and bad vibes from that equine banshee. All right, I guess Any I have to do, you want me to do? chores. Do exactly what you did for me yesterday, and I'll be forever grateful. Start by picking all the ripe stuff in the garden again. Baskets outside. 
Well, I'd better get going. Drop by any time. All right. Oh boy, I don't know what is ripe. Okay, so those definitely aren't. Those aren't. Those look overripe. Okay, I'll go for that. It's so hot, I should get these vegetables into Shorty right away. Okay. Pick those vegetables for me yet? You betcha. betcha. Good for you. Good for you. Now, if you just fill that egg basket mm. for me again, we'll be <clears throat> all set. Okay. Well, I'd better get going. Drop by any time. At least the egg thing is easier. Okay, where's the basket? I don't remember where the basket is. Do I have the egg basket? Okay, now I have to wait for you because you're a nuisance, apparently. Here we go, Sheriff. Hernandez. This is Nancy Drew. I'm the one who yeah, stayed in Shadow Ranch. what's up? I remember. In fact, I spent a good part of last night out there. I know. I never got a chance to talk to you. Is there something I can do for you? Would it be alright if I looked mm -hmm. around in the pump house? Sure. I'm all done in there. Should I have my deputy take that sign down? Mind my asking why you want to look around? Wait a minute. Dave told me about you. You're the girl detective. Amateur detective. I don't know. Dave seemed to be real impressed with you. Huh. In more ways than one, I might add. Oh no. All right, so we have to. Thanks, Thanks for your help. help. You bet. Nope. What's? No, you still have them left. Okay, well I'll try to. Hopefully, I don't have to wait for that chicken to leave. Please tell me this Got is all the eggs, eggs right, right here. here. Good for you. I need you to do one more thing. Uh, it's Tex's birthday. Oh. The Raleigh's told me to make him a cake. Now, if I make it, he'll throw a fit. But if you make it, he might actually appreciate it. So why don't you uh, dig a cake recipe uh, out of the recipe box and have at it? I don't care when you make it, just so it's done by the end of the day. The icing's already made. Could I get a canteen of water for yeah. you? Yeah. You betcha. You're good to go. Well, I'd better get going. Drop by any time. A cake. I have to make a cake. Oh boy. Guess this is the one I have to do. Hmm. All right, so I have to do this. First thing I'll need to make that cake is a mixing bowl. Butter. Missed. What? Half a cup. Missed. Medium. 45. Let's go. Please tell me it's good. Please. Maybe I should try. This tastes terrible. I better throw this out and make another one. I'm following the recipe. What the heck? Oh, I wasn't paying attention to the baking powder. Oh. All right, let's do this again. I wasn't paying attention yes. to that. Ugh. All right, one, two, three, and then three of these. Two, three, 
five milks and seven sugars again. This is like the fourth or fifth time I've done this. I'm gonna be editing Nightmare, okay? Two. Three. Four. Five. One. Two. Three. Missed. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Hooray. Five. Get this in here again. Let's try again. Uh, medium heat. 45. And let's try this again. Please taste good. Please Perfect. tell me I didn't mess it up. Uh. Maybe I should try. I should put that icing shorty made on it. Right click. Pieces to rotate. Oh no. What are these? I made you that flour Francis mentioned in her recipe. What? I got all the pieces out of marzipan using her old forms, but I'll be darned if I can figure out how the pieces go. Um. Oh no. Puzzle time. Oh. You sort of have an imprint. Um. Um, this is, oh boy. I have no idea. Oh, am I getting it? Oh, oh, it's coming together. Hey, hey, did I get it? It's a tulip. What's this? That's food coloring, so you can paint that marzipan flower. Oh. I hope that's good. That seems like it's it. Okay. Miss Nancy, how may I be of service? Well, I'd better get going. Well, I hope soon. that was good. It didn't tell me anything. Okay, I hope that's done. Jeez. All that for a cake. Um... I 
I do find it a little sus that the guy outside of the chicken coop isn't there. I do find that sus. Okay. Unless he's, like, shown up since then. Nope. Has not. Alright, I actually... Let's save. Save. Ugh, this music's so good. Yes. Because we've made progress. Let me in. Oh my. Is there anything of interest here? Oh! Oh no! There's a secret passageway. That's how they did it. Looks like the pipe is pretty badly corroded. Yeah. Ooh. I'm supposed to go this way, aren't I? Check. I did that, okay. Can't check that off yet. But won't I need a flashlight to go in here? I barely see what I'm doing. Oh, where does it go? Dave? <gasps> well, where did you come oh, from? Oh my god. Oh, this scared me. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to sneak up on you, but what are you doing? I'm sorry. I didn't mean oh. to sneak up on you, but what are you doing? Well, see, I just, I mean, I'm looking this for is Dirk weird. Valentine's treasure. How long? Oh. A couple of years. See, my great aunt Ellie was Francis Humber's cousin. When she died, she left me a bunch of stuff, including an old letter she'd gotten from Francis. Oh. Anyway, Francis said that Valentine had hidden a bunch of loot somewhere and wanted Francis to find it by following the clues he left for. Francis was real smart, see? Loved puzzles. Yeah. Played the piano pretty good, too. Anyway. Oh, after boy, Valentine there's gonna be a piano aunt, puzzle, isn't Francis there? Francis was too brokenhearted to care about some treasure. She told Aunt Ellie that if she could find it, she could keep it. I also found this picture. Hmm. That's Francis's father, Sheriff Merrill Humber. There's something written on the back. Stairs to cellar. That's Francis's handwriting. <gasps> Looks like the other yeah. half of the message got torn off. I was hoping that the treasure might be under the stairs in here, but no such luck. How yeah. long have you been digging around down here? About a week. Mostly late at night or whenever uh -huh. I could sneak away. I come and go through a secret entrance. These stairs lead to a secret door behind the bookcase in the den. The hmm. Rileys never mentioned a yeah. secret door. The Rileys don't know. I was afraid that if I told them, they'd... See, my brother's mm. dead broke. No job, health's bad. I was thinking if I could just find the treasure... I understand, but now I'm in kind of an awkward position. I know, and I'll mm. tell them, I swear, soon as they come back. They got enough on their minds right now. Yeah, what about, what about the accidents the, yeah. that have been happening around here lately? I don't know mm. anything about that horse or any of the other stuff that's been going on around here, I swear. Yeah. Now, if you'll pardon me, I need to tend to my chores. No, wait, you don't have to leave. Interesting. What is this? Oh. Oh no, is this a puzzle? Something's missing. Well, there's a puzzle there. Can't use that. Acid. Wonder what somebody's been using that for. Uh <laughs> Somebody used acid to corrode the pipe. I'm waiting for Nancy to get knocked out. Okay, well, I'm not seeing anything else. 
This should be interesting. Looks like I'm back in the den. Huh. Wow. Secret passageway right there and we didn't even know it. Okay, so now I've got purse. Alright, so I found the bottle of acid in the cellar. Did someone use it to gradually eat away at the main pipe so that all he or she had to do last night was give a li it a little kick and kaboom. No more water to the ranch house. No thanks for her father. I forgot Dirk said he'd leave. Oh, right, so research 19th century fashion accessories and learn more about the purse I found. Oh, okay. Looking for green bottle under stairs in s to cellar. Can't check that off till it's done. Why do I feel like it's not this cellar, that there's like another place? All right, let's go talk to people. Miss Nancy, how may I be of service? Hmm. What do you know about the treasure that Dirk Valentine supposedly yeah. hid around here for Francis Humber to find? Let's pry. If I thought there was a snowball's chance in Tampa that Valentine had stashed any of his loot here, I'd be tearing this place apart. Why? What do you know about it? I just heard about it, that's all. When I heard that rumor, I started reading everything hmm. about Dirk Valentine I could get my hands on. But the oh, more so they're I read, all interested. The more it sounded like he suckered Francis into believing he'd hidden something for her just to give people something to talk about when he was gone. Well, I'd better get going. Come all back right. soon. Okay, now that we know where you went to, Hello, can we talk? Nancy. Guess I'm going to be blushing every time I see you now. Hmm. But she's got Ned. Um. Because of hmm. that cellar thing, you don't have to be embarrassed. As long as you level with the Raleigh's like you said you would. Actually, I'm kind of glad you came by. Something I need you to do for me, if you wouldn't mind. You bet. Yep. This chicken coop's been a thorn in my side ever since I got here. The wire I need to fix the hole in the fence was supposed to be delivered today. But it's not here yet, and the Raleigh's mm. just called and asked me to run an errand for them tonight. So if you could keep an eye out for that chicken wire, and patch that hole as soon as it gets here, the chickens and I'd really appreciate it. Will the wire get here before it gets dark? Doesn't look that way. But you still have to put it up, even if it means working at night. Just be sure to wear gloves. I'll leave my pliers out. If you have to do it at night, that's okay. There should be plenty of moonlight. You'll be able to see fine. Just make sure it gets done. Because if it doesn't, the coyotes are going to have themselves one heck of a banquet. And you're going to be in a lot of hot water. No, All sir. right. Now, is there something I can do for you? May I see that hmm. letter you said Francis Humber wrote to your great aunt? Sure, got it right here. When I heard you this were a detective, I started clean. keeping it on me. Thought you might snoop through my stuff or something. Thanks for letting me see it. Dearest cousin Ellie, mm? my beloved Dirk is no more. I shall never see him again. And now you mm -hmm. will never see me again. For right. I'm on my way east, there to spend the rest of my life. I will never return to the territory of Arizona. Not even when my father, whom I despise with every part of my being, has left this earth. But know this, sweet Ellie. Dirk told me that he had hidden something of great value. And that when all was in place, he would start me in pursuit of it. He was forever inventing fanciful ways to tax my brain. And was quite clever mm -hmm. himself. Then, thanks to my father, he was arrested. Perhaps he wrote me from jail and his note was lost. Or perhaps he grew to hate me. But he never told me how to find what he had hidden, and I am too heartsick to care. If you can somehow find it, it's yours, my dear young cousin. Know, too, that I miss you terribly and mm -hmm. always, always will. Francis. P.S. Enclosed is a picture of the vilest man ever born. Interesting. Where was the jail that Dirk Valentine stayed in after he was arrested? Do you have any idea? Probably the one over in Dry hmm. Creek. It's a ghost town now. But the jailhouse and a couple other old buildings are still standing. At least they were last I saw. Oh, going to travel on. On your way to Mary Yazzie's, look for the trail on your left that heads towards Shadow Mountain and stay on it till you get there. It's about an hour and a half's ride. This got something to do with the treasure? I doubt it. 
Well, let me know if you need mm. anything else. I'll let you get back to work. Appreciate it. Cool, cool, cool. So we have to. Maybe we should chit chat with you. Got anything to say? Has anyone hmm. tried going after that phantom horse when it appears? Nope. Always something hmm. else going on. Like Ed Raleigh getting snake bit or the pump house blowing up. That's that so horse weird. Is fast. Probably couldn't catch it anyway. Do you know anything about the treasure that Dirk Valentine supposedly hid for his sweetheart? Nope. Eh, hmm. Somehow I knew you were going to say that. <laughs> Is it okay if I go riding? Nope. Feed the chickens and the horses in the corral first. Could be fatal if you mess up. So don't. Talk to Ugh, you now I have Yahoo. to do these chores. Yahoo! Yahoo to you too. Okay, so Bob gets A. I'm gonna have to look at the others. Two scoops of chicken chow. I have no clue as to knowing which is chicken chow. What is that pink stuff? Why are we feeding horses pink stuff? Is that the corn? That looks more like corn. Oh boy. Um. Two scoops, you said. bucket. Yeah, that's allegedly, according to the hint system, that's the chow for the chicken, so I hope it's right. Okay, chickens, come and get it. Hey, please tell me I didn't kill the chickens. This one definitely does look like corn. I need one of these. Dude, it's not going to be simple scoops, is it? Okay, so... One pound for this stuff, so that should... Okay, yes, yeah, so that put me at three pounds. And then... What am I looking for? Mixed pellet is okay that should that should do it okay bob i hope this works i don't accidentally kill you don't die on me Oh shoot, I need to know. I've got Clyde and Ace. Okay, Clyde. Clyde. All right. Three pounds of oats. One pound and a half of mixed pellets. Okay. This is oats. One pound. Okay, so we're at three. Okay, and then we need mixed pellet. This one? Right? Oh, yeah, yeah, I see it now. Yeah, that's the mixed pellet stuff. The graphics are that ancient. What do we need? Weapon, a pound and a half, okay. How much is one pound? 
half. Oh, alright, so that did it. Okay. Keep. Hooray! Okay, so then I need ace. I'm getting the hang of this mini game. Ah. I gotta put this down. There we go. Okay, so one pound of oats, so one cup of oats, and half a corn. Okay, right, so one and then three of those. So I need two of those. Okay, so one of these. That's the one pound, right? One pound. Okay, corn is half a pound. Yep. Okay, and then I need three for the pellets, so that's two. Yay! Alright. I hope I did this right. Alright, here comes your food. Hmm. They're adorable. Alright, please tell me I got this right. Need something? May I go riding now? Oh, Bob's all yours. I set up some barrels and a sawhorse so you can do some barrel racing and practice roping. Whenever you're out there, I'll watch you and time you. If you get good enough, like, say, you get your time below 10 seconds, and if you can lasso the sawhorse, like, say, four times out of five, I'll give you your very own lariat. You can practice hmm. as much as you want whenever you want. Just don't go walking off with my rope, because I'll be watching. <laughs> oh, no. Okay, so this is how I'm able to get up. That so that's how I'm able to get up to that um, ridge. Can't check that off till it's done. Yeah, I did that and I managed not to fix. Alright, I guess we should find out if maybe that's shown up yet or not. 